ordained this day to honor the man and woman of God for the work that they do, not only for the city, but around the world, but for you, God. Let every eye be closed and every head be bowed. And surround you. Praise the Lord one more time. Amen. Let's give that one more praise because it's worth it. We can never stop giving God the praise and the glory. Father, in the name of Jesus, our Lord and our Redeemer, we thank you so much, Father God, for this great day. This is the day that you have made. You said, let us rejoice and be glad in it. And Father God, we're glad in it today. I thank you, Lord God, for every soul that's here today. I thank you, Lord God, you said in your word that the good steps of a righteous man are ordered by you. And I thank you for ordering every soul that has participated this day for such a great occasion for honoring the man and woman of God. And we thank you for them. We thank you that you continue to bless them, continue to make ways for them, continue to open doors that they may go through, Lord, for the glory of you. But close those doors that you don't want them to go in, in the name of Jesus. But open the doors wide, in the name of Jesus, that they can take this gospel all over the world in the name of Jesus because he preaches the word of God and he don't sugarcoat it God he tells it Lord the way that you would have him to tell it in the name of Jesus Lord that word cuts amen but it only cuts the sin out of our lives a lot of people can't handle the word when it's preached straight Lord at a holy vessel and we thank you for the holy vessels of God I thank you Lord God for them and I pray Lord God that you continue to keep them protect and keep them oh God in all that their endeavors oh God bless their hands bless their going in and their going out bless them oh God Bless them beyond measure in the name of Jesus. And we thank you, Lord God, for them. And Lord, bless all those that have participated, Reverend Butcher and all the other ministers. We thank you, Lord God, because that's an honor when your own fellow workers honor you, Lord. And I thank you for them. And I pray that you'll bless them above and beyond measure in the name of Jesus. And we thank you, Lord, in Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. Let the church say amen. 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 Turn it back. Never win. Amen. Praise God. Amen. We want to praise God for everyone. We want to thank God for everyone coming out and celebrating this day of, um, for our bishop and our first lady at Belton Day. We appreciate the Church of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. We love you. Praise God for you. Amen. Amen. We thank God for the city of Lancaster, all those in the doors and on your jobs and on your lunch break. We appreciate you, Church of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. If we can do anything for you, amen. Amen. We are giving out um, services of our program. If there's anything that the Church of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost can do for you within the power of God, amen, just let us know. We especially want to say thank you to Pastor Busher. Amen. We praise God for him. Let's thank God for him. Amen. Amen. We want to thank God for Councilwoman Barbara Wilson. Amen. We praise God for you. Amen. We want to thank God for Reverend Wells. Amen. We praise God for him. Amen. And also, we're going to not jump over them, but we want to thank God for Evangelist Johnson. Amen. Coming from your PA. Amen. We want to praise God for him. Amen. And for our mayor, the city of Lancaster, Mayor Gray. Amen. We truly praise God for you. We thank you for allowing the Lord to touch your heart to give us this honor, this opportunity to honor this great man and woman of God. We want to thank God for Pastor Rivera. Amen. Being with us. Amen. And we thank God for all the pastors all over the city of Lancaster. Amen. We know if everybody had their desire, they would want to be here with us. Amen. And we thank God on the behalf of the pastor, amen board in the church of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost and Deacon Wilson, amen. We praise God for you, amen. And we ask that our church of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost everyone, that we make sure we clean and get everything back in order, amen. That the Lord will allow us next year to come back. Amen. We thank God for our Bishop Albert A. Belton. Praise God. Amen. Amen. First Lady Belton, we praise God. Amen. When we dismiss, we're going to have a few moments of meeting and greeting with our Bishop. Amen. 
Amen. 20 minutes, amen. We, they can come up and greet them, amen. And then we're going to be prepared so we can clean and take everything back to the church and get everything back in order, amen. Amen. This will be the end of our ceremony, our celebration. But this, right after this, then we'll have our meet and greet. And then after that, we'll be sending away the pastor and his wife for a week-long vacation of rest and relaxation. And I just want to point one thing out. The mayor was supposed to have been away this week. And God touched his heart. However, he did it. He's here. So we thank God for that. Thank you, man, for coming out. And so we'll have our meet and greet. Now we come up here in the shade and greet the pastor and his wife. And like I said, today is their wedding day. If you want to bless them with a hug, kiss, anything financially, you can bless them any type of way you want to. Thank God for everyone. Just a note.